Hey, welcome back to Seller to Seller. I'm here with Keith Pellin. Keith, I'm so I was surprised to see you. Thank you for having me. I was me. told some guy was coming <laughs> to talk about this glitter on the river. I had no idea that it was Keith. <laughs> it, it's amazing. Uh, uh, speaking of, of Keith, it uh, seems like every charitable function, every every uh, really uh, special thing that happens in this city somehow has your name associated with it. Well, you do so much tremendous uh, work in our community, charity work, and I, I know we go to the same church, uh, and uh, you're active there. I mean, what a guy. It's a pleasure to know you. Well, thank you. Appreciate and, that. Uh, it's great to be here. Well, it's, it's, uh, this is, is, a, is a special community, and I think people like Keith here make it special. And uh, one of the, the things that Keith's here to talk about about is the glitter on the river. We've been talking about that uh, the entire show. What's up with that? Tell us about, first of all, is that to help rebuild the uh, environmental learning center? Well, in part, maybe. In part, maybe. The, um, mm -hmm. gl the glitter on the river is the 20th annual fundraiser we've had for the ELC, and this happens to be also the 20th anniversary of the environmental learning center's oh, existence. Okay. So they've been celebrating all year, and we're sort of capping off the year with, with this major fundraiser, which is something that we do every year at the ELC. Um, it's uh, usually at the, a party that's held at the end of the season, mm -hmm. and um, it's always a great time. We, we, we have prided ourselves on keeping a, a low ticket price and you know, getting a, a really great diverse crowd from, from here in Vero Beach. And, and it is, of course, for a great cause, as you said. Oh, it's incredible, Learning right. Center. I've actually been involved up there practically since I moved here. Oh, I know. You've been hanging out there for a long time. You really have been involved. Yeah, and, and we're, we're so fortunate. I'm chairing the, the event this year, which I've been on the committee for a number of years. I've never mm -hmm. chaired it. Doing it this year, and if you've seen the pictures of the committee in the paper, I'm like the thorn amongst the roses. That's so right. A lot of ladies on that committee, on this committee, <laughs> and me. Um, but but they've all been great, and we're having a good time. And the, the event is Saturday the 25th at 6:30 in the evening. All right, coming and, up uh, soon. Coming you up know, soon. I, I got a, uh, a notice of it on uh, on email. Somebody emailed me a little mm -hmm. invitation, which is great. And you know, I read it, and it's great, and all that. But boy, until I talked with Laura here, I had no idea. Really, I mean, she's she's doing like a 97 tasting or something I mean yes, the yes. wines and the food are going to be incredible what there's a special chef that's going to be there as well well we've stepped it up a notch this year in terms of the party and, and for those of you who might have been at the event last year it was a little warm that evening so ah. we've, we've uh, gotten ourselves a larger tent we've installed air conditioning uh, so it's going to be a much better evening hopefully than last year and yes, in terms of uh, the, the work that Laura's doing, we one of the one of the auction items we had this year um, is a is a dinner party that's being put on or, or with a guest chef, Virginia mm -hmm. Willis, who has some very great credentials. And this year, Laura has offered to uh, sort of team up with her um, to participate in that auction event. So mm -hmm. some lucky bidder is going to win this wonderful dinner party where Laura is going to be doing a wow. wine tasting, and Virginia will be cooking dinner in your house. Um, for as many as eight people and um, I actually had the chance to meet Virginia last year when she did this for us We didn't have quite the wine component last year that we we hope to have this year So um, this should be a really great auction event and we're looking forward to well. It sounds really special It does I, I, and uh, some lucky person certainly will it's going to be great yeah. and uh, the, your crowd especially all your your co-chairs on the uh, on that committee are, are people that always put on a wonderful event well indeed and we have We've had some sponsors in the community who have been with us for a lot of years, and we're really pleased to have them, most of them back again this year, and it should be a, a great event. I know I'd ask you to name them, but the list is long, and it you is forget long. somebody and you offend somebody, that's so I'm not even going to ask you to, to try, but uh, all the, the usual suspects are there, I'm sure. Yes, you indeed. Know? Yes, indeed. Uh, and the people that are the backbone of this wonderful county and uh, wonderful area that we live in, it's incredible. So uh, how did you find out about this wine shop. Have you been here before? Or? I have not actually been here before. You know, I, I live in Vero and um, oh, it's such a long as as I drive. I know, how long, so. seriously? How long did it take uh, you to drive here? Realistically, fifteen minutes. About fifteen minutes. All right, yes. <laughs> <laughs> you're all the way down to Vero Beach. But so. I, see, Laura came to us through Kirsten Murphy, who is um, one of the ladies on the committee. Oh, ah, okay. Friends, and uh, Kirsten asked Laura to get involved in this particular auction item, so she graciously offered to do that, and that's that's how we. That's how you got hooked up. I know. I. I uh, met Laura through a charity event too and uh, and when I found this little spot I mean it's a little a, a wonderful little shop and uh, shop. you know so she's you, if you uh, attend uh, uh, participate in charity events I'm sure you're going to stumble across Laura sooner or later but you want to come down here ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Can you take home, oh thank you very much I appreciate that this well, is another thing that they're starting to do here I mean they do uh, they do hors d'oeuvres light light things uh, they, they serve beer wine What's not to like about not that? Like, it's just right. incredible. 
Well, we're running out of time. Uh, good to see you, and, good to see you, Bob. Uh, and congratulations on another time. fine event that you're uh, that you're chairing. And I know it's going to work with you at the helm. How well, could it go wrong? That's great. It should be great. Thank you, Keith. Thank you, uh, Bob. Well, we'll be right back. Stay tuned. I think Bob's coming back to speak more with Laura. And uh, here at Inlet Wine Store, I want to call it Inlet Winery. I can't help it. It's it's uh, got that atmosphere. So stay tuned. We'll be right back with more seller to seller. <laughs>